Hello everyone. I am Dr. Shrikant Raju, consultant vascular endovascular surgeon. Uh, today I came here to discuss about one important topic that is AU fistula procedure. This procedure is usually done in kidney patients who requires dialysis. AU fistula is nothing but surgically created root for the dialysis. It is created between artery and vein by joining it surgically. That can be done at the wrist and even elbow. They are usually native AV fistulas and uh, AV grafts. Uh, native AV fistulas, usually single stage AV fistulas, you, which can be done at wrist and elbow on both upper limbs. And it, when it comes to dual stage AV fistulas, they are called as basilic vein transposition. They are done at the elbows only. Usually vein will be lying on the medial side. First, we will do it as a uh, procedure. First, as a AV fistula, we do it at the elbow. After six weeks, once the vein matures, we usually shift this vein to the anterior aspect of the arm. So after again six weeks, this will be ready for the dialysis. So for a dual stage AV fistula, it usually takes nearly three months for the fistula to mature. So out of these six sites at which we can do AV fistula in both upper limbs, some patients can have all the six sites as an options. Some patients can't even have a one single site for doing this procedure. In such patients, we opt for an AV graft. AV graft is nothing but in that we use a PTFE graft which simulates the vein and uh, that can be used as a material for doing the AV fistula. Uh, many people ask which one is better. Usually natural AV fistulas are always better when compared to AV grafts. Why? Because they usually last longer and the infection chances are very much less and complications are less in these uh, patients and the cost of procedure is also less. That's why we usually opt for uh, native AV fistulas as a first option. Usually after doing this AV fistulas, it usually takes six weeks for an average in, uh, Indians for its size to mature from two to three mm to six mm size. After it attains six mm size for the vein, we usually uh, do dialysis through that and uh, post procedure you will have stitches at the site of procedure that stitches will be taking out after two to three weeks during this period they have to do an alternate day dressing and once uh, post procedure we will ask the patient to do a softball exercise initially for one week to ten days we usually ask them to press that softball or a smiley ball uh, for about 15 to 20 times per an hour Following 10, 10 days, we will be asking them to do n number of times, however they are comfortable when they are awake. Uh, this is how you have to manage uh, this uh, fistula patients. Once it is matured and enough size, then they can do dialysis through that. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel. That is Dr. Srikant Raju. Thank you.